Okay, so and Eric, both of you did a good job on this on the written test. Good grades. And well, now we're gonna begin with the oral test. Let me read the instructions to you. You have four minutes to sustain a conversation. Okay, that means you need to speak without stopping, no pauses. Next, you're gonna use the questions below as guide questions. You know, use these questions right here as a guide. Give me a minute. All right, yes. Use these questions right here as a guide, All right? So those questions are questions that you need to ask each other, but it's not an interview, it's a conversation. So use these questions as a guide, as a guide in your conversation. You know, if you run out of things to say, use these questions. If you don't finish all the questions in four minutes, it's okay, but you must speak the whole four minutes. Ask and answer the questions as quickly as possible. Ask follow-up questions to make the conversation flow. So yes, use these questions, but ask extra questions too to make the conversation flow and to complete the four minutes. And make sure that you give each other the same opportunity to speak. That means if your partner is quiet, ask them a question so they can begin to speak. Both of you need to speak equally. So, Eric, do you understand? Thank you. All right. Um, read the four questions to yourself. Do you understand them? Yes. Yes. Are you ready to begin? Or no? Are you ready? Yes. Okay. Well, I set a timer for four minutes. Whenever the four minutes are up, I will tell you. In the meantime, I'm going to take notes of your conversation. Please begin. Okay. Um... Eric, uh, what kind of music do you like? Um, well, um, I like to listen um, pop, um, electronic music, and sometimes banda. And you, what kind of music do you like? I like pop and classic music. And um, do you like classic music? And um, sometimes when I play chess, I like to listen this music. But um, what's your favorite singer? Um, Ed Sheeran. And you? Um, the Weeknd. Um, for you, who's the best singer in the world? Well, I just I just know, um, Ed Sheeran. Uh, I like how he's sick. Mm. Who was your weekend? Well, it was Lauren and Bessie. And you, how was your weekend? Uh, me too. Uh, my, my weekend was busy because I helped my sister with study exam and help with her homework. Okay. Um, what kind of clothes do you like to wear? Well, um, I like the jeans, um, shirt of different colors. I prefer black shirts and white shoes. And you, what kind of clothes do you like to wear? Well, um, I like to to wear hats and wear, um, I, how do you say? 
dark, sometimes dark, dark colors and um, I, I like to wear dresses or um, or sweaters. Um, did you consider yourself a well-mannered person? Yeah. Um, my my aunt always, well, um, I always have good manners when I have I with other people. And you, do you consider yourself a well-mannered person? Uh, yes, I'm. I'm considered a uh, a uh, well mannered person because sometimes when I'm going a important place, I need to have good manners. Um, Eric, is your internet okay? Sully, can you hear me? Yes, teacher. Eric, hello, hello. Uh, hi, sir. Uh, can you hear me? Yeah. It cut off. Can, can you can you repeat that again? The last thing. Okay. Yeah. Um, I'm considered minor person. And sometimes when I go in an important place, I need to. Teacher, how do you say buenos modales? I need good manners. I need good manners. May, for example, say thanks, shaking hands, and something like that. All right. Well, the four minutes are up. Thank you so much. So, Eric, you are both. Really good conversationalists. I appreciate that. I know that both of you are very are really dedicated in the class. That's a good thing. So look, a few things. Eric, you said I like listen pop. You're missing two words here. I said I like to listen pop. Okay, sorry. I like to listen pop. You're missing one word now. Which word are you missing? I like to listen to pop. To pop, yes. And then you said, I like to listen this music. Ah, Eric, I like to listen... I like Two. To leave. That's one. That's a tough thing. You know, a lot of my students forget that listen to is a phrasal verb. That means there's at least two words that make one verb. It's a phrasal verb. Um, the second question is how was your weekend? Now who? How? This word right here, repeat after me. How? 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 How was your weekend? And then, and then, Zoe, you said it was bored. The correct answer is not bored, it's boring. Do you remember why, Zoe? Yeah, because we use it when it's a uh, action, and we use X when when our missions, I guess. Kind of, kind of. So we use ed adjectives to describe feelings, and we use ing adjectives to describe people, places, and things. 
not feelings. So because you're talking about your weekend, you know, your weekend is Saturday and Sunday. And days do not have feelings. They're not alive. So you have to use ing adjective because days are things. And we use ing adjectives to describe things. Okay. And Eric, you said, I like the jeans. Remember, in English, we don't use the to generalize. And it's because you're not specifying the jeans, just say, I like jeans. Okay, I like jeans. Eric, how do I say, me gustan los gatos in English? I like cats. I like cats. Okay, again, without the, in Spanish, we say los gatos. But in English, we don't say the cats. That's weird. We only use the to specify. And when we know what we are talking about. So that's it. Um, so it, I'm going to give you a 95 on the speaking and Eric a 90. Is that fair to you? Is that fair? Is that just? Is a 95 and a 90 okay? So it says yes. Eric, how about you? Okay, it's okay. All right, great. Well, that is all, children. Thank you so much for your participation, and I'll see you tomorrow. Okay, I'm going to begin with your next classmates. Have a wonderful day. Bye, teacher. Teacher. Take care. Okay, Javier, I want you and Adriana to read the instructions and read the questions. You have one minute. Adriana and Fabricio, are you ready? Yes. Yeah? Okay, thank you. Well, Adriana, Fabricio, please begin. Okay, um, Fabricio, what kind of music do you like? Um, I like the, the written music, but um, this, this week I listen really, really much Cuco, uh, Corridos Tumbados, uh, Bad Bunny, and uh, Luis Miguel. I love Luis Miguel. Uh, how are you? Mm, I I like to listen to pop music, um, um, rap. In English, um, and that's it. Um, which which song do you like from Kuka? Uh, sorry. What's your favorite song from Kuka? Kuka, uh, this lo que siento. I love this. I love this song. My favorite part is where where sing. Uh, Oye, cariño, solo pienso en ti. When I wake up in the morning, on to back to sleep. This is my favorite part. Um, do you like Cuckoo? Yeah. No, it's fail. Mm, it's famous in on TikTok. Yeah, really. Yeah, it's very famous. What is your favorite song? The same. And another, but I don't remember the name now. Uh, can you sing a little part? No, I don't like to sing. Okay. Um, do you like Bad Bunny? Yeah, I love Bad Bunny. It's my idol. <laughs> Why? I don't know. I I love uh, Benito Martinez. Mm, who is Benito Martinez? Bad Bunny. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Um. How was your weekend? The Benito Martinez is the the real name. 
Yeah, but I'm the, I'm the other question. Okay. How was your weekend? Uh, good. I don't know because uh, I just sleep every weekend. Uh, I I didn't nothing. Uh, how are you? It was good, but the only thing that I don't like is that I had a lot of homework. Because like now we're on exams, so I have projects, um, exams, so I need to study hard. Now you have exams? Exams? Yeah. Uh, no, I have, I had exams the last week. Yeah, the last week. And that uh, was, excuse me? Sorry? No, continue. Uh, sorry. Okay. Yeah. I had uh, exams last week and this this week uh, give me the, the grades and you. Hold on. We're finished. Adriana and Fabricio, good job. Good job, good job. Basically, the whole conversation was about music. It's amazing. That's good. You can make a conversation flow, and I like that. <laughs> and Adriana learned Bad Bunny's real name. <laughs> <laughs> that was weird. <laughs> it's cool, it's cool. Um, Fabricio, uh, you have a question? Yeah, uh... ¿Cómo se decía ídolo? Es que fue lo prefiero. Yeah, no me acuerdo. My, my idol, idol. Oh, ok. Thank you. <laughs> You're welcome. All right. I, I like this. What's your favorite song of Puko? That's what you said, right, Adriana? Yes. All right. What's your favorite song of Kuko? There are two different ways to ask this question. It's not of Kuko, it'd be by Kuko. What's your favorite song by Kuko? Or the second question would be, what's your favorite Kuko song? Both of them are equally common. What's your favorite song by Kuko? What's your favorite Kuko song? All right. And that's it right there. Adriana, I think you said now it's famous on TikTok. Is that correct? Yes. Who? Kuko. Oh. So it's now he's famous on TikTok. He's. Okay. Um, and Fabricio. It's my idol. <laughs> it's pronounced like this. Idol. 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 And it's not it. It's because it is para una cosa. It's for a thing. And that yeah. bunny is not a thing. So he's a man. Uh, he's, he's my, my idol. idol. He's my he's idol. My... Okay. Very good. Very good. I did it nothing. This is not correct. I didn't nothing is not correct. No hice nada sería I didn't do anything. I didn't do anything. Yes, I know in Spanish, it's only one verb, no hice. And English is didn't do. Two verbs, two verbs. I didn't do anything. Okay. All right. And, and this week, Give me my grade. Me da mi calificaciones. I, I would say this. And this week, I get my grade. I get my grade. Or, or and this week, 
they're giving us our grade. Okay, Alicia? Yes, teacher. All right, all right. Adriana, I'm going to give you a 95 on the speaking test and Fabricio, 90. Is that okay? Yes. Yes. All right. Thank you so much, Adriana and Fabricio. You're doing a good job. I am satisfied. I'm really happy with your speaking test. Okay. Thank you, teacher. Have Thank a you. wonderful day. See you. See you. Thank you for the class. Uh, <laughs> yeah, the, the test. Ryan and Javier, remember, you have four minutes to speak. Okay? You cannot stop speaking during those four minutes. Besides these questions, you need to ask more questions. Okay? For example, um, what kind of music do you like? I like pop. Who is your favorite singer? My favorite singer is Michael Jackson. What's your favorite Michael Jackson song? Uh, my favorite Michael Jackson song is Billie Jean. Okay. Do you know the lyrics of, Julie, of Billie Jean? Yes, I do. No, I don't. You know, ask more questions, not just these questions. Raina, Javier, do you understand? Yes. All right. Whenever you begin, I'll start the timer. You have four minutes. Okay. Um, hey, Raina. Hi. Who are you? What? <laughs> How are you? I'm good, and you? Me too, me too. Um, oh. You listen music? Yes, I listen music. And you? Yeah, me too. Um, what kind of music do you like? I like electronic music, rock, and pop. And you? I like everything, but I like more um, electronic music. And it's so that I don't remember good the name. Funk, I think. <laughs> yeah. And how was your day? And good. That's good, my day. And your day? Me too. I have two exams today. That three <laughs> with this. Um, how was your weekend? And my weekend was good. We made carne asada and I helped I helped clean up my house. Do you do a party? What? Do you do a party? No. No, I I don't do that party. I think and you? because always that the what one person is I don't know eating carne asada or doing her house sometimes. We surely, sorry, surely, if you are a party, I don't know. <laughs> oh, okay. Well, no, we only um, was, uh, we only was my mom, dad, brother, and sister, and me, and my, okay. and my pets. <laughs> to pass a time with family, yeah? Yes. <laughs> what uh, kind of clothes do you like to wear? I like jogger shirts that are a bit open, that don't have design, designs, and that are dark colors. And you, what kind of clothes do you Me like too, to wear? Me too, but sometimes I think I like to use um wool wool clothes i don't know oh. right, but i think it's it's good i don't know oh, uh, okay. i some usually i use deportive clothes i don't know for what i i didn't do nothing and i used <laughs> um tell me about you do you consider yourself a well-mannered pe person? I, I think so, because my mom raised me very careful. And, well, 
I grow up with what she taught me. <laughs> and you? Do you consider yourself a well married person? Yeah, too, me too. I, I think I help a lot of persons. I don't know that you need a pencil. I, I can give you my pencil, I don't know. It's an example. Uh, okay. In my school. And what is your band favorite? Favorite. Mm, Twenty-one pilots. Mm -hmm. And your favorite band? It's um. I think weekend. The weekend. The weekend. Oh, okay. That's good. Yeah. <laughs> I right. I. The last day I listen a lot of the weekend. Your music is so good. <laughs> yes. Do you listen to other artists? What? Do you listen to the other artists? I don't know, uh, um, her style? And yes, I listen to Imagine Dragons. Um, the artist, well, the band, the other band, I listen to Imagine Dragons. The, and the artist, I Listen, mm. Bruno Mars, eh, Narina Grande, and the Danish. And you? I I listen. I be don't know for what. I listen Ghost to Man. It's called Ghost to Man. I don't know for what. Um, to Imagine Dragons. What more? Um, I listen other groups, but it's singing Spanish. In English, I sing this. Billie Eilish, have it. Uh, other, but I don't remember the name. But I remember I say, <laughs> I don't remember. Um, <laughs> what is your favorite food? My favorite food. Um, um guys, you may stop. Ah! You, you could have stopped like two minutes ago, but I just let you continue talking. <laughs> Chilaquiles. <laughs> All right, good, good. Well, look. I, I love you like you list too. L let me tell you something. First, you did a good job. You know how to make a conversation flow. I want all of your conversations to be like this. I want all of your conversations to be like this. You know, speak, don't be scared. I know a lot of times, you know, we're very dry with our conversations and we don't want to be dry. It's not good. We can't practice English if we're being dry. My first thing, though, you listen to music. There is one little thing that you forgot after listen. Which word goes after listen? Our? You listen our music? No. At? <laughs> no, not at either. Come on, Diana, you know this. Oh, but is it really listening? Do you listen? Do you no, listen to. You listen to music? You listen to music? Yeah. I like electronic music more that's perfect i like electronic music more more don't say i like more electronic music say i like electronic music more okay me gusta más la música electrónica is i like electronic music more javier do you understand yeah all right cuéntame de ti no es tell me about you is tell me about yourself. Tell me about yourself. Tell me about yourself. You need to use a reflexive pronoun in that phrase. Tell me about yourself because you tell me about you. So you tell me about yourself. When the person who does the action is also receiving the action, 
use a reflexive pronoun. So I say something about me. So I'm talking about myself. If you say something about you, you are talking about yourself. So tell me about yourself is the correct expression. Javier, how do you say cuéntame de ti in English? Tell me about yourself. Tell me about yourself. All right. I grow up with what she told me. I would say I grew up with her values. I grew up with her values. Yo crecí con sus valores. I grew up with her values. Raina, did you grow up with your mother's values? Uh, yes. Yes. Good, good, good. Thank you. Javier, I help a lot the persons. Remember, I wouldn't say persons. Persons is more like a legal term. Like the two persons were involved in this accident. If you want to talk like normal um, day to day, if you want to sound like normal day to day English, I would say I help people a lot. Javier, do you help people a lot? Yeah, I help people a lot. Only young people or also old people? Also old people. Also old people. Very good. Very good. Now, what's your band favorite? I wouldn't say what's your band favorite. Come on. What is the correct way to say this? What is your what band? Favorite band? Favorite band. Very good. Very good. The last day I listened a lot the weekend. El último día escuché music, escuché mucho eh, the weekend. The last day? The last day of what? Do you mean yesterday, Javier? Yeah. Okay. Yesterday, I listened to The Weekend a lot. Remember, listen to somebody a lot. I listen to, I listen to Drake a lot. Raina, who do you listen to a lot? Hmm? Who do you listen to a lot? I listen to Drake a lot. You? I listen to... I, what? <laughs> um, what's that? Um... <laughs> Put an artist uh, right here on this line. What's that? I listen um... to Drake a lot. You? Uh, I listen to Drake a lot. You you listen to Drake too? Ah, Drake. And I don't know what is Drake or who okay. is that. Then, then write or say the name of another artist right here. Do not copy um, me. I listen to Drake a lot. What about you? And I listen to Bruno Mars a lot. Very good. Javier, how about you? Yesterday, I listened to 21 Pilots. Very good. All right. Raina, on the speaker, I'm going to give you 80. And Javier, on the speaking, also 80. Is that okay? Yes. Yes. All right. Raina, 80 on the, on the digital test. Okay? Okay. All right, but look, Raina, I need you to participate more in class, okay? Ask many questions. Ask all the questions that you want. Okay. Don't be distracted. Don't use your cell phone while you're in the class. All right? Javier, same thing to you, man. Focus on the class. Don't play games. Mm -hmm. All right? I appreciate you, both of you. Have a wonderful weekend. Oh, have, have, a, have a wonderful day. Sorry. No, See you tomorrow. Bye-bye. <laughs> See you. Bye-bye.